Do you feel this will be a better offensive line this year? Um, I want there's there's an answer I want to say right away, but I don't want to diss on Sco or Taylor. You know, um, I think we will be very successful. I think so. Well, I was just going to ask you. Yeah. I mean, maybe you already asked about yeah. how the chemistry changes without Luan and Schofield. Is yeah. that a good a good thing? Yeah. Well, yeah. I, I answered the, the, the one guy mm -hmm. earlier, and I said, um, you know, last year it was it was kind of like it was kind of like um, Sco and Taylor, mm -hmm. and, uh, and that was good because I think I think we needed that leadership and stuff. And for whatever reason, it didn't, we didn't have that good of a year last year, as we all as we all know and stuff. But I think the five of us all being young. Is really allowing us to like mesh and come together in a way that we didn't, we didn't, we didn't last year. Like when we, like this year when we screw up, like we all we're all doing the same thing. So it's easy to like coach each other and not try to like be on different levels, like because we're on the same level. Mm -hmm. I think that brings a level of like comfort to us that we didn't have last year. And so I think I think yeah, we're gonna we're gonna be pretty good. With them, did you feel like you had to live up to something with, with Stokeville and Milan there? Um, yeah, I mean, yeah, I mean, to a point, because you know, those 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 are your seniors, guys. Yeah. Those are the guys you want to emulate, and those are the guys you don't want to screw up. And like, because if you screw up with those guys, you rag on yourself because it's like, oh, I'm not I'm not living up to to Taylor, or I'm not living, living up to Sco and stuff. And um, you know, just ha I mean, having those guys was crucial, I think, to our ability to like, grow and stuff. But I think it's, it's also a totally different experience now. We're growing with each other, mm -hmm. not from them. But has has having Magnuson be out, you know, affected you guys then in terms of your ability to kind of gel together? Um, yeah, I mean, kind of, because I mean, you know, when, when Eric comes back, everyone expects Eric to come in. As like, I mean, I expect Eric to come in, coach to do everything, and um, Eric, he'll be he'll be ready with plenty of time. I'm sure, you guys talked to him already, but uh, yeah. What was, what was the question again? Does it sort of affect your ability <laughs> to gel together as a group? Oh yeah. Um, no, I don't, I don't think it will. You know, I mean, spring practice is only. It's only 50, 15 practices, and um, you know Eric. Eric is a super smart guy. So like, even though he might not be practicing with us, he's always out there coaching us with Coach Funk. And and, and if say if I have a question or Ben or David Bosch and anyone has a question, we all come to Eric because he's sitting there with Coach Funk. And um, I think that's kind of his way to get in the spring ball and, and develop with us, even though we can't do anything physical. You said you guys are growing together. You remember last year, yep. and you're confident that this year will be better. How much of it is also? You guys don't really have a choice. You have to be better. Yeah. I mean, how much do you look at it in that way? Uh, I mean, we definitely, we definitely feel the pressure. Not, not from outside sources, but, right. but with, within ourselves. I mean, we all know last year was not a good year. We all know the bowl game was not good. And I think, I mean, we've definitely been talking about that all year. I mean, if you go in the weight room, we have signs of everywhere, reminding us of all this stuff. And uh, I think the worst part about it. The whole entire thing is just having to wait, having to wait to regain the respect and all that stuff, you know. Because you, you got basketball going out there, basketball's doing awesome. <laughs> and I'm like, where, I'm like, I want to do football school. <laughs> so I just want to get out there, like have fall come around, and it's just a pain. But I think, I think we're all just super excited. What kind of reminders do you guys have, like negative rushes or little things like that? Or what? Uh, the whole entire last season. It was yeah. just a, the whole, I mean, the first, what was it, what did we go, 5-0 or something like that? Yeah. 5-0. and 0. And, like, you know, that, it was positive up until that point, but that, after that, it started going kind of downhill. And for whatever reasons, we didn't finish as much as, as like we want to. And it was just, there's no hiding. I mean, there's no, everyone's going to look back at, at that season until we go into this next season. And I think it's just, we always want to get to next season. It's kind of what sucks. What else what do you got? Oh, I'm sorry. I was just going to ask about the signs. <clears throat> Oh, the signs? Uh, confidential. <laughs> but uh, I don't want to give any giveaways to any teams or anything. Who? I mean, you could probably guess. I don't say that. <laughs> what else do you think you have to do to get to that point where you need to be for the fall as a unit? Uh, obviously finish out the spring, the spring strong. You know, they're the, the first, the first uh, you know, because we had the two practices and then we had the week off for spring break and then we came back. And the first week was kind of rough. And then, then this past week has been a lot better. And then, or last week was a lot better, and then this, and today was was really good. And I think the key is just keep getting get more and more consistent, because you know, I'll screw up or somebody else will screw up, and like it'll be a repeat error that you have to get fixed. And I think that's the main thing for all of us, all of us being a young group, is to have that consistency. And then obviously, <coughs> take the time off, get rested up for spring ball, and then have a super strong summer, coming to fall camp ready to go, and then take it from there.